Robin Goodfellow's Racing Tips, Best Bets for Saturday, February 16. Sports Mail's racing expert Robin Goodfellow dishes out his tips ahead of Saturday's meetings at Ascot, Winkington, Haydock and Kempton. Topville Ben has looked highly promising in two starts over fences at Hexham and Weatherby where his fencing technique has been exemplary in the main. The larger obstacles look to have made a man of him as he is settling better in his races now and arguably doesn't need to blaze a trail anymore to produce his best. Selection, Topville Ben Danger, Mr. Malarkey Remarkably, this is a first-hand decap over fences for Black Horton, and B, and he makes some appeal returning to a venue where he was highly impressive 12 months ago. Events haven't panned out for the selection this term, but he has twice run well in defeat including last time Yavar an inadequate trip behind top notch at Kempton. Selection, Black Court and Danger, Rayakers Island Clan de Obeuks was arguably value for more than the one and a half length winning margin in the King George VI chase as he pulled himself up a little when hitting the front. This looks the perfect stepping stone prior to launching a concerted gold cup but next month. Trafalgar returned to form at Cheltenham and looks the chief threat. Selection. Clan de Obauk's Danger, Trafalgar's Getaway Trump and Al Dancer look too smart novices in the making and they may have a little too much class for their rivals. It is difficult to separate the duo as they have trod similar paths this season, but marginal preferences for the former who has enjoyed a good campaign despite the suspicion a sizable field and stronger gallop would produce further improvement. Al Dancer boasts plenty of pace and could prove a formidable adversary. Selection. Getaway Trump Danger, I Dancer fans of waiting patiently have been forced to do just that with the talented 8-year-old making just one appearance this season. It is safe to say the Northern Raider didn't enjoy much luck when brought down in the King George VI chase and could bounce back today, however Cy Ername impressed over course and distance last month when finding a great rhythm at his fences and if he can recapture the level he may be tough to reel in. Selection, Cy Ername Danger Waiting patiently a drop in trip may work the oracle for Magic Saint who hasn't appeared to get home a couple of times over further distances at Haydock and ask it for new connections. The handicapper has offered the French recruit a little respite for those defeats, indecent handicaps, and today's test should be more suitable. Selection, Magic Saint Selection, Magic Saint Danger, Gino Trail Sir Royal uses this event as a stepping stone for the champion chase but that doesn't mean he should be ignored on his return to hurdles. A disappointment in the Tingle Creek behind Altier, the selection will find today's ground more suitable. Was third to stable Mitt Yanworth in this contest two years ago and may go two better today. Selection, Sir Royal Danger, Vision of Day Flows Shades of Midnight has plenty to find with Stairs Hurdle 6th Yanworth and Kilcooley on official ratings but he boasts a fitness edge and perhaps more importantly has plenty of track experience. He was unfortunate to be collared near the line by Paisley Park here and his conqueror dominates the stairs hurdle market. Selection, Shades of Midnight Danger, Yanworth last year's winner Yala and Key has had this race as a target for a while and a seven-week break should ensure he is fresh and well as he looks to repeat last year's heroics. First time blinker should assist Red Infantry who is a threat, while Welsh national runner-up Ramses de Tilly and 2017 winner via Line Rouge give David Pipe a strong hand. Selection, Yala and Key Danger, Red Infantry The absence of Gold Cup favourite presenting Percy has robbed the race of stature and glamour, but it presents a good opportunity for Monley to put his career back on track with a win. The Ryanair remains a feasible target for the eight-year-old who may see his biggest threat stem from Kiloltavik. Selection, Mon Lee Danger, Kiloltavik Robin Goodfellow 1.10 Catpoli 1.45 Magic Saint 2.20 Molly Childers 3.00 Sir Royal 3.30 Sandhurst Lad 4.05 Some Chaos 4.35 Pen Lane 5.10 Flaws Boy Sam Jim Crack 1.10 Catpoli 1.45 Big Marcher 2.20 Atlanta Blaze 3.00 Vision Day Flows 3.30 
4.30 Sandhurst Lad 4.05 Like the Sound 4.35 The Eagle Who Slanted 5.10 Soul Saver Robin Goodfellow 12.50 Torpillo 1.25 Jester Jet 1.55 Shades of Midnight, Nap. 2.25 Scorpion Sid 2.55 Silva Eclipse 3.35 Yala and Key 4.10 Cajun 4.45 Road to Rome Jim Crack 12.50 Torpillo 1.25 Lascadine 1.55 Shades of Midnight 2.25 Manuel 2.55 Sykes 3.35 Impulsive Star 4.10 Cajun 4.45 Pacadu Polder Robin Goodfellow 1.40 Zero Generous Jack 2.10 Brel and Daz 2.45 Pistol Whipped 3.20 Halo Moon 3.50 Lord Dumaisno 4.250 Eshades of Grey 4.55 Trail Boss Jim Crack 1.40 Generous Jack 2.10 Brel and Daz 2.45 Cage 3.20 Volt Face 3.50 Uno Mass 4.25 Risk of Find 4.55 Mr. Stan Robin Goodfellow 1.30 First Link 2.05 I'm Available 2.40 Desert Doctor 3.15 Jogago 3.50 Isomer 4.25 Miss Green Dream Northerner 2.05 Reggae Runner, Nap, 2.40 Gulliver, and B. Jim Crack 1.30 Soaring Spirits 2.05 Chop Chop 2.40 Desert Doctor 3.15 Spring Romance 3.50 Nanios 4.25 Miss Green Dream Jim Crack 1.10 Catpally 1.45 Big Marcher 2.20 Atlanta Ablaze 3.00 Vision Day Flows 3.30 Sandhurst Lad 4.05 Like the Sound 4.35 The Eagle Who Slam 5.10 Soul Saver Robin Goodfellow 4.40 Dehai 5.15 Charlie Arthur 5.45 Nylon Speed 6.15 Treacherous 6.45 Roman Spinner 7.15 Great Britain 7.45 Casper the Cub 8.15 Majorette at Looking for Pointers for Next Month's Cheltenham Festival Racing Correspondent Marcus Townend Picks 5 to Watch on Saturday Di's A B A Ascot 12.30 beat yesterday's Sandown winner Queen of Hearts last time. Quoted for the Albert Barlant 16-1 and Ballymore Novices Hurdles 25-1. This test should tell us where he stands. Torpillo Haydock 12.50 has easily won both his races in this country. A 14-1 shot for the Triumph Hurdle but faces his stiffest test yet against Grade 1 winning hurdler Quell Destin. Yanworth, Haydock, 1.55, hasn't run since finishing 6th to Penn Hill in the Stairs Hurdle at the 2018 Festival but remains an interesting contender for that race again if he goes well here. Cateson, Haydock, 4.10. First run at 3 meters for the gelding that was third to champion Newberry's Chilo Hurdle. His 21 odds for Albert Bartlett Novice's hurdle will be cut if goes in. Pack a dupe holder, Haydock, 4.45, has won the last two runnings of the Fox Hunters Chase and this will be his one prep run before attempting to make it three in a row under jockey Harriet Tucker.